Wonder Earth Vegan here, back with another episode of Kerbal Space Program Season 5. Last episode we did a, uh, sort of a space station, and then we took it back apart and re-entered the orbit. We still need to do a manned Kerbal, Kerbin orbital docking because I had four Kerbals, and I was supposed to only have at least one, apparently. Uh, I mean, I was supposed to only have between one and two, and I had four. I didn't notice that line in the the thing there so we'll have to do that at some point but uh we can do that maybe maybe next time this episode we're going to try to rescue one of these kerbals from the orbit of Kerbin. Uh, which one i'm not sure but as soon as we rescue them they will soon be renamed and uh, added to the roster as the new member of uh, of the crew, so uh, Gage and uh, Mumbo, all you guys who have requested uh, requested people, I've got a list. Don't worry, I've got a list. I've got a list of what what you wanted them and uh, how you wanted them configured, and I will certainly oblige all of those. So I'm not going to be necessarily rescuing you from space because. I have to change this after I rescue them. I mean, I can change it before, but then I'd have to exit out of the game, and I'm already in the game, so I'm not going to. So, yeah. <laughs> so, let's do a rescue mission. So, what are we going to use for the rescue mission? Well, Lancelot Mark II sounds like a pretty good plan, honestly. Mark II is pretty good shape. For a rescue, I can just pop on the parachutes again here, just like so, and then uh, this guy's ready for a rescue. I can go on rescue him, and uh, yeah, it's be, be no problem, be no problem at all. So, the Mark II will be the rescue vessel, I reckon. And who are we going to take up here to rescue? We got uh, Steve and Jacob. Let's take, uh, let's take Steve. And uh, he'll do the first rescue. Maybe Jacob can do some rescues after that. I need to start adding a utility wrench to these guys, to these parts here. So I'm going to add that in here just so that we'll have them. Uh, in the future okay so yeah Lancelot will have the wrench in there okay um I think we're ready yet there's not much to do really for uh, the rescue all right are we ready for launch in three two one launch and we're off a quick and easy launch into orbit to rescue some Kerbals. Should be a quick and easy mission, I think. I hope. Alright. Don't ask me how these Kerbals live who are needing to be rescued without life support. And yet, my Kerbals can not live. But that's neither here nor there. That's neither here nor there. We're just here to do the job. We don't ask questions. Don't ask questions. Just do the job. Alright. Very good. Now let's target one of these bad boys. And see if we can uh, rendezvous with one of them. Who we got here? Sergi. Sergi here has an apoapsis of... 84 and a periapsis of 75 very similar to my own okay how are our okay so we do probably need to adjust the plane point four is actually pretty close already but we're going to go ahead and get it to what i like to call a zero so let's uh decrease this down get that to zero it's just a tiny burn. It makes it a lot easier to do 
all of our rendezvous so we're going to do that and hopefully get this guy out of space before he runs out of food and water and air there we go all right so you can see we have a pretty good separation here so we're gonna have to do some L orbitos let's add a maneuver here and see if we can get oh my two days that's not gonna happen that's not gonna happen all right so let's go to our periapsis we're gonna have to do it similar to what we did with the station I have to burn up like that okay so let's do maneuver node execute I'm gonna burn up a little bit that way we can get our orbital time changed time to orbit changed and then we won't have to have as many orbits here all right cool All right, bink, there we go. So now I can set up a maneuver node here and we can, get, oh yeah, look at that, that's beautiful. Only two hours of worth of orbits to get into a pretty close intersection here. So let's see what we got. Let's bring her in to under two kilometers, but closer if we can. How about 0.1? That sounds good, doesn't it? 0.1 kilometers. Let's set that maneuver node, execute it. All right, here we go. I'm gonna do two rotations, maybe three. Yeah. Four rotations, still. Plenty of, that's only two hours. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. I'll let him do the burn again. I'm really enjoying him, them doing these burns. I thought I wouldn't like it, but uh, <laughs> now, that I, now that I've had them doing it, it's, uh, it's actually quite nice. Okay, so we're going to go to the target down here. We're going to burn retrograde, and um, burn the difference in our targets here, and get ready for the burn. Uh, this is going to be a lot easier because we don't actually have to dock with his vessel. All we have to do is rendezvous with it. Okay. There we go. All right, so let's take a look at the screen here. Let's find our buddy, Sergey. Is that him over there? Yeah. Speed up time. He should start getting closer. Here it comes. He'll be coming around the mountain as he comes. He'll be coming around the mountain as he comes. He'll be coming round the mountain, he'll be coming round the mountain, he'll be coming round the mountain as he comes. All right, so we now have Sergey here. 
Go ahead and pop on out, Sergey. And head on over to the other vessel. He's going to board the other vessel. And then we'll deorbit and uh, we'll have another Kerbal. The first Kerbal to be renamed. I'll have to see who's next on the list. I, I can't remember who it was, but uh, I want to say it's probably Mumbo. I don't remember what the name of your Kerbal was, but I have it written down. Don't worry. I have a whole spreadsheet. All right. What a sight to behold. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All aboard. All right. Sergey is on board. Let's see if we can target the uh, the space center this time. Yep. So, how are we looking on food and water? Can we wait till daylight? I think we can. All right, we're gonna burn. Pretty good. And then uh, just going to get ready to uh, reorbit here and re enter orbit. So let's go ahead and bring that back antenna back in. All right. Bingo, bingo, baby. All right, coming in, looking good so far, pop those off, yeah, I, I way underestimated that. Drogue shoots, pop, pop. Main shoot, deploy. We'll try to keep all of this that we can. And just like that, we have rescued our first Kerbal. Wow. Surprised that broke off, but that's okay. I guess it's okay. Maybe if I'd done a little burn there at the end, I could have saved it. All right, cool. So we rescued Sergey. Sergey has been rescued. He's going to run off. and But we're going to get a new crew member. Super excited for it. Super excited for it. What do we get for this? We got uh, Save Sergey. He's now part of the space program. Performed a crew transfer near Kerbin. And we also got extra money for rescuing Sergey. All right. Well, I guess that's going to be about it for this episode. It was a short one, but I appreciate your attention. Be sure and smash that like button. I may do some more rescues in some upcoming missions so that we get more and more crew members. But I think the next episode, we're going to try to do uh, something with the moon. What, you say? Well, hmm. perhaps we will try to orbit the moon in a manned flight. But we'll see. Be sure and stay tuned. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Ship or a burden thing. They made a fire.
o'clock hour.